Welcome into Sweet's Post Game presented by Cascade Natural Gas. I'm joined alongside our high efficiency play of the game in Cooper Cross. Sweets on the wrong side of things tonight. 7-2 to loss uh, to the Springfield Drifters. First ever meeting between the two franchises, but to start, obviously not on the side you would like as well as the team would like. Just initial thoughts coming off, thanks. Uh, I think we didn't have the best energy going into it. Uh, I think we were a little tired from the road trip and the the hard series we just came off of Corvallis so I think that was a factor and we just didn't have the energy coming out so I think that's why a couple of, a couple of changes in the midway part of the game you were able to stay in and work in that DH role we'll talk about your day as it was pretty effective but a couple of different changes what was the like mindset behind that with uh, manager Brandon Van Horn going through things and six guys out of the starting lineup all substituted I think he thought we didn't have the energy for our pitcher and weren't playing for the team and uh, I think he thought those guys were taking it a little selfish and almost taking it for granted, so that's why he ended up pulling them out. Let's talk about you individually, though. In that inning where a couple guys get substituted out, you stay in, get a big-time two-run shot, help the Sweets get back into the ball game. At the time, was able to cut the deficit to only one. Yeah. Was a crucial spot. You come in and get that hit out of that field. It felt good. You know, I, I went in there knowing I was going to get something good to hit, and I just saw it well and caught it out front, so ended up working out good. <laughs> And then talk about you individually. You talked about coming off the tough series versus Corvallis as a team. You've had a little bit of time off and yeah. kind of trying to get back to the swing of things. Today, definitely were able to do that. Felt good to probably get a big time hit in the first game in two weeks or something like that. Yeah, I mean, I think it was, I needed a little mental break. And um, yeah, but it was good to get back out there and I was ready to go. I knew I was going to do something good today. So. <laughs> Go back and talk about today's contest, a 7-2 to loss for the Sweets. Go back tomorrow, 635, same spot. Had this discussion uh, last contest uh, with Rafa in Game 2 versus Corvallis. How do the Sweets rebound, try and get back on track tomorrow? Oh, I think we're for sure going to be ready to go now because, you know, we all know that the energy was lacking. And um, I think that's something that we're going to pick up tomorrow and we'll be able to play better as a team for sure. Well, Coop, appreciate you. As always, you're a high-efficiency player of the game. This has been Sweets Post Game, presented by Cascade Natural Gas.